for Sheffield coach Mike Barr following the season opening game, uh, lost to the Smithport Huppers. First of all, Mike, what did you see today from your team? Well, uh, you know, I saw our kids, uh, our kids come out ready to play football. I think Smithport was just a hair more physical than we were, mm -hmm. and we've stressed that physicality all uh, all season. And I, I just. That's a good football team. I mean, you know, they're low in numbers, but Coach Jack, I give him all the credit in the world. Uh, his boys came ready to play, and, you know, it, there's a lot a lot to us coming back for our first football game of the uh, of the season. You know, some kids haven't seen a football field in a year. Some kids haven't seen it in two, three years with some of our new guys out. So, you know, it's going to take a couple games for us to get uh, where we need to be. Uh, definitely, you know, the score doesn't reflect the passion that I have for these kids and the passion these kids have for football and you know there were some bright spots out there today and so you know what we're going to build on those bright spots fix some of the small stuff and, and we're, we're going to be competitive yeah and defensively speaking of bright spots you were able to force some turnovers absolutely and, and that's you know another thing that we've tried to really work on is you know ball hawk fly to that ball and let's try to you know if, we, if we're physical with the ball carry and we're physical there, you know, things will happen. And, and that was evident today. I mean, we were able to cause some fumbles and turnovers. You know, um, mentally, offensively, uh, I'll take the responsibility. I don't feel I had them ready. And first year head coach, first game, I'm not making any excuses. I know what I have to do now to make sure they're ready going forward. So, and I owned that to my kids. That's the first thing I did when I went in the locker room. I said, hey, fellas. I feel this, and this is on me. I'll take this, and I'll be better. I promise you I will be better at it. So uh, I take a lot of ownership for that. And how much of it, too, for a lot of these kids, is getting better will just be getting getting those reps? And that's it. Um, you know, I, again, I don't feel – I've said it, and I don't know if this is the right terminology, but I don't feel we'll hit our stride until week three mm -hmm. because getting them to see game speed. You know, another thing I touched on in there was, guys, you see game speed now, you see it, that needs to transport to the practice field. We need to be that fast on a practice field. That's what helped prepare us. So, um, absolutely. I, you know, we're still jelling. We're still coming together as a team. We're still working out bugs. But, you know, the one thing that I feel, communication was great. The one thing that I asked the players all year long, if you see something on the field, make sure you're coming off the sideline. And I had receivers and I had running backs and linemen. They were all coach this, coach that. And we were able to make those adjustments on the fly and be successful with that. So there is promise. There's a lot of promise there. All right, Coach. Well, thanks so much for your time. Best of luck going forward. Thank you.